A local group hoping to change the educational system throughout the state, kicking off their efforts today to get their measure in front of voters. Caroline Derby live at the Capitol tonight after attending an event for Arkansas Educational Rights Amendment. And Caroline, this is the start of months of hard work ahead of them. Bob Laura, that's right. After the Attorney General approved their ballot title last week, the group has gotten to work this week, including tonight with the kickoff rally. However, not everyone's on board with this ballot measure. Side by side, the group 4A Our Kids kickstarted their effort to get the Arkansas Educational Rights Amendment on the November 2024 ballot. It's going to literally change the Constitution in Arkansas when it comes to education. Kamara Seals, the policy director at the Arkansas Public Policy Panel, says the ballot measure aims to provide access to pre-K for three and four-year-olds, after-school and summertime programs, quality special education, services for children in poverty, and more. We can get their signatures, and then if we get the signatures, which we will, we can go, the people can vote, the people will decide. With people lining up to sign, Abel Riesma, president of the Arkansas Education Association and vice president of 4A Our Kids, says the measure also would require any school receiving any amount of public funds to follow the same standards that traditional public schools are required to follow. I'm ready to hit the ground running to get these signatures on the petitions. We did reach out to the Department of Education about this. They said the governor is proud to have enacted transformational reforms to give every kid in Arkansas access to a quality education and a lifetime of opportunity. It's sad that there are some who do not want to give our kids every opportunity to succeed. The group will need to gather just under 91,000 signatures over the next four months to put this on the November 2024 ballot. For more information, you can visit our website at krk.com. Reporting live from the state capitol, I'm Caroline Derby, KRK4 News. Caroline.